Continue my adventure. 21 Pokemon? Wow. I'm just slaughtering people. Hey, love and gems. <laughs> hey, loveys and gems. Veronica Nocturne here. So, um, yeah. What are these things? Oh, I found the full heal. Nothing over here. All right. So much chop. A chop is stomping on a flat earth. What says you, Mr. Baldwin? This is my land. All of it. I owe everything to this square area here. I'm having my Pokemon use bulldoze to prepare the site so I can build something here. You cheap labored self. No, oh, because there's nothing there. What says you? Oh, did you just... I get so sweaty after doing sports and I end up feeling all grimy. Speaking of which, uh, you know Grimer. It's born from ocean sludge. Not sweat, I guess. Okay. I guess that's the thing. Uh, what says you, Pokemon man? Welcome. May I help you? I'm here to buy. Um, I don't need Pokeballs. Um, actually, no. I'll take... Wow, 700? How much does it heal? 60. Am I... Do I need 60, though? I'll... I'll... Take some of these. Yeah. Okay. Um... I don't know what we need. I don't wanna no I don't wanna buy anything and then mean like you don't need it, you know? There are wicked people out there who use Pokemon to do awful things, stealing other Pokemon, selling them for ridiculous hype prices, and you want to know where these bad folks all gather? Team Rocket, that's where. Somebody like Team Rocket. What's up you and your high heels? I think Pokemon can be good or bad. It depends on the trainer. You imagine you just walking up to a random person and they're just starting off a conversation that where you think you left off? This thing here is in for resting your feet on, you know. It's for tying up your boat. Thank you. I didn't know that. What says you, bird lady? I'm getting my Pidgey to fly a letter to Saffron City in the north. Need a run? Gee, I wish I could take a trip aboard the SS Sand someday. I could make new friends all over the world. <laughs> so, are we going board the SS Thingy Majig right now? What does this say? Oddish is happily staring at the swaying flowers. There's nothing there. All right. There's a notice posted by the Vermilion Police. A sleeping Pokemon has been blocking the way on Route 12 lately. Detour through the rock tunnel if you need to reach Lavender Town. Take a look cave. Okay. North. City. Suburbs. Crowded. <laughs> the music drastically changes. So where is this? To the SS thingamajig? Oh, what says you? The SS Anna is famous for luxury cruise ships. It visits Vermilion Port just once a year. And just my luck, I'm on this very same... Am I battling him? Welcome to the SS Anne. But not so fast. Do you have your ticket, young lady? You flashed your SS ticket at the man. I flashed him. Yep, that'll do. Welcome aboard the SS San. Oh, and that's not all. You're the 100th guest to join us aboard the SS San today. So here you go. Please enjoy this breezy outfit as you feel the salty air on your skin. 
you got a sailor set from the crew member. You put the sailor set in your clothing trunk. Hold on, my friends. We can accessorize clothing trunk. But if Wild Style doesn't get one, I, I don't think it's going to be okay. Oh, she does. Clothes. Sailor T. Sailor cap. Sailor top. Sailor shorts. I get sailor shoes. I got a sailor bag. Now I'm Sailor Moon! <laughs> okay. Now let's go. How far away is this thing? Wait, 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 wait. Ah. I didn't know it was that big. The SSN. Oh, God, jerky pants. Oh, there you are, Veronica. Thanks again for the ticket. This ship is huge and full of trainers. Bonjour. If it isn't Veronica and jerky pants. Didn't think I'd be seeing the two of you here. Hey, Blue. Are you taking a cruise? Not hardly. I got invited to an exclusive party for trainers, but I'm pretty much done with this scene. I got plenty of party favors too here. I can even share one with you. You got a solution from Blue. Oh, it's a medicine thing. More importantly though, you wanna know that I ever heard at the party? You guys know about Team Rocket, right? Seriously? You must have been fearless or something, kid. Anyway, the point is this. Team Rocket is a dangerous group and they're trying to use Pokemon to make themselves rich. I might do some digging into what it is they're really after. And you two better stay out of their path. I hope you fall on your face with your satchel. Your passengers arrest us after being out of the sea for so long. You might get challenged by a battle by some of the really bored ones. Oh God, here we go. Waitress, yes, you waitress. I need a slice of cake. The finest custard cake you have. So a random person walks to your room and the first thing you say is, yeah, give me a slice of cake. Wigglypuff. I always travel with Wigglypuff. I never leave home without it. Without her or him. A word, a world cruise, a word cruise. A world cruise is so elegant and nice. I collected these Pokemon from all around the world. Congratulations. The lady down the hall was the custard cake if you want to tell her about your... Okay, she's level seven. Wow. <laughs> Just headbutt it and take it down, please. yourself critical hit pinji fainted she's gonna bring out somebody else i don't know what level the gym leader is gonna be at otters grew to level 18 otters wants to learn razor okay Five and accurate. 
Let's see the hundred. Oh, forget this. It's not like riding a bike. They forget all the time. Magic carp is useless, but it's still growing. Keep battling. Oh! Double kick. Come on, kick his butt. Okay. I got 108 XP. Oh no, I went around the world for these. And I got a hundred a thousand twenty squiggly peas and three Pokeballs. Don't get on my girlfriend. Oh my god, I didn't see the short person in the corner. I love Pokemon, do you? He really like I hate this chair. I really do. You are challenged by Youngster Tyler. He has a manky. What level is he? 16. I feel bad, but... Thunderbolt him. Electrify. Just die. Technically don't die, they think. I need 7 XP. Wow, you're great! 320 squiggly peas and 3 Pokeballs. They give like the same thing for every single battle. I found a paralyzed heal. Nope, nope. Haha, -ha, we're cruising around the world, my children and I. Spoiled brats. What is he mad about? Shh. I'm an agent for the international police. I'm on the trail of Team Rocket. They're up to nothing good. Okay, bye international dude. Uh, I'll loop it around, right? Loop it around? Bonjour, I am Lee Waiter on the ship. I will be happy to serve you anything you please. Ah, le strong silent type. Tres bien. Tres bien. Tres bien. Where am I going? Where am I going? The kitchen. <laughs> soup. I need a... Never mind. I got a super repel. Why are they turning? You there, ma petite. We are busy here. Out of the way, shoo shoo. Have you ever wondered about these silver domes we put on top of the food? They are called... Cloches? They are deep, hot dishes with co for, from cooling. I'm so busy... I can't talk today. I'm so busy, I'm getting dizzy. You have to give me room here. You're the one spinning in circles. Mm -hmm. I feel spuds every day. He's, that's, that's what they're doing. You Have you heard about the Snorlax? It's a real glutton. No other Pokemon eats and sleeps the way that Snorlax can. I only get to peel onions. What you gotta say? <clears throat> Indeed, I am Zisha. The main course today is the Cantonian flavor of future crunchies. Les guests will, mut <laughs> will mutiny, I fear. Yeah, considering you're going to feed them chips. Okay, that is the kitchen. So we will go up the stairs. Is he going to... 
This ship, she is a luxury liner that Pokemon trainers the world over love to get ride on. Every time we pull in support, we have a fancy party to invite all the best trainers to attend. Okay. Uh, let's go up. Let's see what it is. Our captain is a sword master. He's awesome at sh using chop down. They say he'll teach his move to anyone who shows potential. Master, I need your chop down. Okay. Wildstyle wow, seems very, very excited. It seems like Wildstyle wow, wants to see what's up ahead in the ship. Oh my god. Ahoy there, do you not get seasick on ships? Come on, sailor face. Oh. He has two Pokemon. I'm gonna kill all these people. I'll keep them. A chop! I'm confused. Does he have like gills on his chest? Cause I was just careless. 1,080 squiggly peas and three Pokeballs. I'm gonna have so many Pokeballs, I'm never gonna buy them ever. Oh, it looks beautiful. You gaze over the wide open sea together with Wildstyle. Wildstyle seems really happy. No matter where Wastel look, its eyes are full of wonder. Give you some of those. Yes, I will. You're so adorable. I just don't get them. I don't I know. Hey, matey, let's do a little jig. That didn't sound right at all. It really didn't. Sailor in. That's the first time he's seeing him. Oh, and you are going to faint automatically. Yes, you are. There you go. Sorry. Not sorry. Sandshrew go to level 15. Impressive, you took the wind right out of my sails. I'm not gonna, I'm just gonna read what they say, not the repetitive stuff, cause that's just, it's annoying. The party is winding down. It's about time for the ship to set sail. Not with me on it, it doesn't. Ugh, I don't feel so good. I came out for some air because I got seasick. Don't you throw up on me. Scrubbing the decks is hard work. 
Okay, so we came out here for no apparent reason whatsoever. But we found out that um Captain Capitan has what say ye? I've journeyed far and wide, but I'm in all my travels. I've never seen any Pokemon sleep like that one. It was massive, huge, round Pokemon. Are they talking about the Snorlax? Okay. Hi, I guess. He's gonna battle me, but. Fisherman Dale got a magic card. Let's see if yours is more useful. I think mine just learned how to slash. battle him, but the point is that we need the XP to fight. Small trees can be chopped down by the masterful secret technique chop down. I, I kind of put two and two together. What are you staring at? I've seen Pokemon. I've seen the Pokemon fairy people cross the water. I really have. You imagine you walking up to somebody, I already said this, and it's like, they start in like a mid-conversation, and you're like, did I leave a conversation? Oh, we gotta battle these ones. The way that they're standing? Oh, I kinda figured that. Competing against the young keeps me useful. Alright, remember you said that. Gentleman Brooks. Ooh, a Ponyta! <laughs> Not bad. The first ever Pokemon to ever give me a hit. young again you don't look young you look like you're freaking out let me just get this over with yeah I got you which do you find to be more worthy a strong Pokemon or a rare one if a strong Pokemon is better is like stronger than the rare one does it matter if it's rare gentlemen Lamar he sends out a sand turtle. So he shrugs off our electricity. So we're gonna headbutt him.
Headbutt him again. Four times. Okay. Can you headbutt him, please? Thank you. That's right. Oh, you jerk! What happens if I actually use it? Let's see if I... Yeah, it doesn't affect him at all. Oh, he avoided the attack. How nice. We're both avoiding each other's attacks without moving. It's awesome. Oh, I actually moved. Come on, headbutts, headbutts. Kick his butts. Kick his butts. You're too good for that. That's right. Level 22. I beat Gentleman Lamar. I must salute you. please I've got a nugget is it a McDonald's nugget because I'll take it have you been to the go park complex in Fuchsia City there are many rare Pokemon there okay good to know me and my daddy love the go parks I wish we could go there again. I hear it's really quite common. People getting seasick, that is. The captain says he's awfully sick. He was looking all pale, too. Need me to rub his tummy? I'll rub his tummy. Hey, Veronica, over here! You see those stairs there? The captain's quarters are up there. He can teach you this cool secret technique if you ask him. He's really famous for it. Though, he looked pretty done in by seasickness when I saw him. Hey, before you go meet him, how about you take, how about I take a look to see how well you've been raising your Pokemon, huh? Oh, God. How many times do I have to kick your butt before you learn? Weird. 
An oddish. Let's see if we zip zappy him, see what that does. Zip zippy! Okay. Like, oddishes are resilient. Oh. You put me to sleep, jerk. Die. Mankey's at level sixteen. I forgot we had him. added to the Pokedex. This Pokemon is full of vitality. Vital yeah, vitality. <laughs> it consistently flies around its large territory in search of prey. Don't be mad. Wow, Veronica, you, you, you've gotten pretty strong. Uh, uh, nothing. That's cool. Anyway, Go meet up with the captain and have him show you the secret technique. Uh, I feel terrible. Uh, this sickness has done me in. You rub the captain's. <laughs> there, there, old fellow. Oof, thank you. I'm feeling much better now. So, what did you want from me? Oh, you want to learn my secret technique? Oh, of course. I'd be happy to teach it. Come along with me. <laughs> that Pikachu looks more than ready to learn my secret technique. But I'm afraid it's really only for humans. What's this? You really want to try to learn it no matter what? Well, color me surprised. I've traveled all over this wide world, and this is the first time I've had a Pokemon want to learn my secret technique. But with spirits like that, well then, who am I to say no? I'll teach my secret technique even to that Pikachu of yours. Come with me, my little friend. Now watch carefully. Aya, Ta-da! Wild Style learned the secret technique chop down. Woohoo! It really went and <laughs> learned chop down. Using chop down, your Pikachu will be able to help you chop down thin trees. You could go give it a try, huh? That's right. How about the trees around Vermilion City? Phew! Now I guess it's about time for the SSN to set sail again. This may be goodbye for now until the next time we return to Vermilion City. You don't got goodies in here? No, nothing? Uh, 
Okay. Let's go. I didn't go to the other side, did I? So we'll go down to the first floor. We came from this side. We didn't do this side. You look tired. Would you like to take a short rest? I'm glad everyone is looking refreshed and chipper now. Oh, I'm sorry for fusing fussing over you. It's just because you look like my little sister. Okay. What are you doing? I wish to be left alone. Get out. Excuse me. That's not creepy at all. Staying in bed, doing nothing during my much-awaited cruise trip. Wow, what a luxury. Is this like a whole separate section? I was thinking I might be able to hook you as a fishing buddy too. Okay. Oh god. Fine. Oh no. You found a super potion. We caught all our Pokemon while we were out at sea. kid you're gonna grow up into an amazing adult thanks dad what is he staring at ha 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 want to be a sailor mate they gave it to me don't make fun of my outfit it looks gorgeous Partner Machoke is super strong. He has enough strength to even shove big rocks out of the way as if they were nothing. Okay, we can get off the ship now. Would have never finished. so caught up in sketching with the ocean view here that I guess I missed my ship. That's awful. Mm, I guess I'll stay here for a while in that case. I really like the color of the sea in Kanto anyway. What do you... How about it? 
Ultra want to try battling my fairy type Pokemon? Why not? if I use that. Level, I would have had my butt handed to me. Auto screw to level 19. Magic carp to level 14. I beat trainer Mina. I'm shocked at your strength. And I've got a bottle cap? What does that mean? Ah, oh, wonderful. You and your Pokemon battling side by side. Now that's a great composition. I love to draw a picture of you two. Okay. Oh, so they want me to use Chop Down already? Chop down. Do you want to use a secret technique? Chop down. Good work. You chop down that troublesome tree and open the way to the gym. And that means you can challenge the gym leader now. I'll be waiting for you there. What do you have to say, my good sir? Which Pokemon do you prefer? The puppy Pokemon Growlithe or the scratch cat? Pokemon me up. Ah, you didn't have to answer. I knew that answer. Sorry, it was a stupid question. If you catch five of the puppy Pokemon Growlithe, I'll give you a great Pokemon you can ride on its back. Can I ride a Growlithe? I'm particularly fond of bird Pokemon. Me and my partner Ducks here are going to go catch a Sparrow now. Okay, Sparrow it up. What is this? It's a Pikachu. Would you like to look at my Pikachu's adorable tail? Okay. I just adore my seal. It's so lovable. It squeaks cute when I hug it. I can't. Okay. 
Our chairman is very outspoken when it comes to his op opinions about Pokemon. I'm the chairman of the Pokemon fan club. I raised more than 100 Pokemon. I'm very fussy when it comes to Pokemon. I surely am. So, do you come to visit to hear about my Pokemon? Yeah, why not? Oh, you see my favorite? Rapidash is the cutest. It's so cute and lovely and smart. It's almost as cute to take. Plus, it's really amazing when you stop to look at it. Don't you think so? Ah, yes. It's like <laughs> it looks... I'm getting tangled up. It looks are so stunning and its heart is so kind. You can help but to love it. And when you hug it tight when it's sleeping, it's so warm and cuddly. Plus, it looks spectacular, of course. Oh, and it's simply ravishing when... Oops, look at the time. I kept you too long. Thanks for hearing me out. I want you to have this. You've got a Pikachu set from the chairman? It's a costume set that you can use to dress up like your Pokemon. Is it for me? Now we look adorable. Yep, oh, sorry. What is this called? Pokemon fan club, all Pokemon fans welcome. Some Pokemon don't just want to walk with you. Some would rather give their trainer a ride. I bet it would be pretty great to take a ride with a Pokemon that could swim across water or fly in the air. No, no, I, I, I got it. I got it. I wanted to talk to the fish that's flapping. Waiting. Your Pokemon should be all better now. Let's see what these folks have to say. Hello there, young lady. Would you like to trade your Geodude for my Geodude? No. Even if Pokemon are the same level, that doesn't mean that one is always stronger than another. But a weak Pokemon can get stronger than more candies you give them. Watch what I hear. Have I talked to these people already? It's true that higher level Pokemon are stronger, but all Pokemon have weaknesses too based on their types. Basically, you're gonna have... Yeah, I already talked to all these people. A better chance at catching a Pokemon with a Great Ball than with a Pokeball. Even then, it is not a guaranteed catch, of course. I know that. When the ring color is green, it means that the Pokemon is easy to catch, right? And when it is yellow, it's a bit harder. But when it is red, it becomes super hard. Aim for the sensor when the ring is small. I hear that the trick is when throwing the Pokeballs. 
I fed a nab a nad nab berry to a wild Pokemon and it seemed to calm the Pokemon down. It stopped jumping around so I was able to aim with my Pokeballs easier. I'm tired. I had to take uh, some allergy medication. So the SSN has departed. I guess she'll be back in Vermilion Fort about this time next year. Yeah, I remember that. All right, now it's just straight to the. Gym. I gotta, I gotta do this every single. Wow, what type of miracle fluid do they feed this tree? Vermilion City Pokemon Gym. Gym Leader Saint Surge. Lieutenant Surge. Saint Surge. The Lightning Lieutenant. We are screwed. Why are you winking at me? I've been waiting for you, champ, in the making. Lieutenant Surge here is, is the gym leader in this city. He's an expert of electric-type Pokemon and a real tough guy. Flying and water-type Pokemon don't do well matchups against electric types. You'll also want to watch out so your Pokemon don't get stuck paralyzed. And here's the last tip. Lieutenant Surge is a cautious type. He puts barriers between himself and the rest of the room, so it won't be easy to get to him. Okay. Nope, there's nothing in this trash can. There's only trash in here. That's a red trash can. I think I got that. Electric barrier has been deactivated. Oh, okay. So it's the third one, right? Yep, third one. Okay, so I found the switches without battling anybody. <laughs> Doesn't it look like uh, the guy from Street Fighter? Ten Hut, welcome to Vermilion City Gym. We, <laughs> we, will you look at the at a pint-sized challenger? Haha, <laughs> you've got a big and brassy nerve to take me on with your puny power a pokemon battle is war i'll show you civilian i'll shock you <laughs>
about to send out Magnemites. Uh, I'll keep battling. Let's see what Double Kick does. Mm, not that bad. No! Sonic Boom! Gosh darn. Level 23. I'm growing before your very eyes. He's about to send out a riot chew. Oh, he's level 26. Holy crap. Um, I'm going to try to heal. I don't know if that actually... Ooh, super potion. Don't let him hit you in that time. No quick attack. You jerk. So, first we're gonna use double kick. And we're gonna see how you like that. Ah, not that much, all right. No thunderbolt, that's not gonna work on me. That still hurts me though. Headbutt. Why does his quick attack go first? Jerk. Oh, I'm gonna do this. Super motion. Full heal. No thunderbolt. Not gonna work. Okay. We're going to headbutt. Come on, headbutt him. Almost there. No more thunderbolts. Let's see if Zip Zappy works. Not very effective, but it got the job done. 442 squiggly... No, I mean Squidward Peas. Pidgeotto's at level 19. XP. Sanshu's at level 16. Sanshu wants to learn Fury Swipes. You in the learning of the moves. 60, that's all it has. 18 and uh, the target is ranked to this long time. It never misses. Forget that move. He learned Fury Swipes. Now that's a shocker. You're the real deal, kid. Best. Fine, then take a Thunder Badge. You got a Thunder Badge from Lieutenant Surge. And that's not all, your special kid. And take this. You got Lieutenant Surge's autograph. You jerk. You put the autograph in your bag. <laughs> Don't worry, that's not all I'm giving you. You got a TM-36 Thunderbolt from Lieutenant Surge. You put the TM-36 in your TM case. TM-36 contained the electrifying Thunderbolt. Teach it to an Electrotype Pokemon for some extra shock value. Okay. I'm gonna go heal my Pokemon. When I come back, I have to chop the... 
Miracle fluid, that's what they give it. Oh, it's you again. Oh, wow, so you beat the turn surge? You must be pretty good. Glad to see you're really learning a thing or two and your Pokemon must be tired there. Missy healed your Pokemon for you. Okay. Oh, me? I'm going swimming in the sea. There are times when you just want to break free from the puny little pool and swim in the big blue. Where are you heading next? Have you been to Diglett's cave? It's pretty close by. If you haven't been, I could show you the way. Want a guide? Should I do this? Cards if I said yes. This is Diglett's cave. Diglett dug out this cave path all on their own. Okay, see ya. Be sure to give me lots of Pokemon. That's what it was. That's what it was. Ridiculous. So, actually what I'm gonna do is she healed my Pokemon. I'm going to save right here and just when I come back in um, I'm just gonna like beat the other little puny guys at the like inside the gym I just wanted to save time and yeah it's just I've been doing the Super Mario Odyssey and they've been taking time like four or five hours at a time and it, it strains me <laughs> So I wanted to do a nice, relaxing, thin episode today to then get back on it tomorrow. Anyways, I love you guys. I hope you had fun. I did. I like the fact that I kicked this butt. <laughs> I'll see you guys next time. Bye.